Hello everybody, I want to show you with this video how you can transfer data from the internal storage to the micro SD card at the Samsung Galaxy A33 5G. For that you will need a file explorer and there's already one pre-installed. If you swipe up like this so that you're in the app drawer you will find it here at the Samsung folder. The app we are looking for is named My Files. Tap on it. So now we are in and uh, first of all we have a nice overview here in categories uh, for all your images, videos, audios and so on. But we will need here internal storage. So tap on internal storage. And now you will, <laughs> now you will see all the folders which contains uh, content you can transfer to the SD card. Okay. Um, I would recommend to you to start at first with the pictures and videos you did with the camera because this kind of data takes a lot of storage. So you will find them here at the DCMs folder and then at the camera folder and here they are. Okay, to mark one of these files, just long press it. So now it's marked now. And now you can mark also some other files here. And if you want to select them all, just tap here and they're selected. And yeah, now you have the chance to move the files, what I recommend to you, or you can also copy them for the safety and so on. Now, but we want to have more uh, space on this internal storage, so just go and move. So now go back to the main view, scroll down a bit, and then you uh, tap here on the point SD card. So now we are on my SD card. As you can see, I have already some folders and I really recommend this to you because it's much more organized. Because if you put everything together, if you mix up your pictures and documents and so on, you will lose completely the overview. I would recommend to you to uh, create some folders. You can do that here at the three points and go on create folder. No? Then you can make some folders. I have already a DCIM folder here. So I will go there. Go to the, I have also a camera folder. Okay, now I'm here. Uh, at my folder where I want to um, have my selected pictures. Then I go here on move here. And now the pictures I wanted to transfer are transferred now to the SD card in my selected folder. Let me go back here and go also here on the folder, the house, to go completely back to the main view here. Uh, I want to show you something more at the internal storage because the same thing we have done with the files, you can do it as well for complete folders. So just long press a folder you want to transfer like this, so that's marked. Now you can mark also some other ones and you can move them here completely no? without selecting the files just like that. No? You can completely move also folders. But please take care that there's really no operating system data or something like this, because this could damage the system. As you can see, pretty easy. Okay, let me give you one more advice. Uh, so for that, just go here to the camera and uh, you should check also now something here, the settings. Go here on the settings for the camera. Then scroll down a bit to the point storage location. And uh, if there's actually, um, like at me here, the uh, marked internal storage, change it to the SD card. Because that means that your future pictures and videos you're doing with your camera goes directly to the SD card and then you save a lot of time because then you don't have to transfer them all the time and so on. Yeah, I hope I could help you with this video and answer your question. And uh, yeah, maybe if you want, you can leave me a nice comment or give me a something up that would be very helpful for my videos. Uh, thank you so, so much for, and you have created also some other uh, videos if you're interested in with some more tips and tricks and so on, or you want, if you want, you can also subscribe me. Uh, thank you so, so much for all your support. And uh, yeah, maybe until next time. <laughs> Ciao.